Hi, I'm Chet Nichols. I'm an IFBB pro and I'm also a coach. Today, I'm gonna to give you some tips to really grow that back. Let's do it. So what we're gonna do on this exercise is we're really gonna focus on the stretch in the back. Stretching the muscles is a big part of hypertrophy and not a lot of people do it enough. This exercise really makes you do it. It emphasizes in the whole rep range. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna have Bree step up on the seat and I want her to step back, okay? And she's gonna keep her legs as straight as possible. And when she goes down, pull, let it go. She's gonna go down real slow. She's gonna dip her head and let her shoulders come up. Get a really good stretch. Stretch all the way from here. I mean, you can feel it all the way down into your hamstrings. All right, go ahead and pull back. Come all the way back to your chest. And she's actually pushing her, her glutes back, ensuring that she's getting a good stretch all the way here. So when she comes back, it maximizes it going forward. Now let's go. This is a nice slow rep range too, or a lot, nice slow tempo. Good. Good. There you go. I really love this exercise because there's not another exercise that I can do right now that gives me a good stretch from top to bottom of the back. Good. Breathing is very important. Exhale. Cool, good, that's it, nice. You feeling it right here? Here? All the way down, good. Notice those legs. Slight bend in the knees. We don't want it locked out, but we won't want it bending too much either. Let's give me two more reps. Good. Now that last one, I want you to hold for five seconds and really just relax, breathe, let that stretch come. Nice stretch, you feeling it? All right, three, two, one, good. I think the best method, or the best time to do this exercise would probably be about maybe your second or third uh, workout because one, you really want the muscles warmed up before you get such a stretch in here because I mean, it can be pretty harsh. Obviously you wanna get a good stretching going on before you work out, but you know, I like to do these second, maybe do some regular cable rows first and then go into this. Now, if you're doing something like FST7, then this will be a good one to do as an FST7 set or going right before you do an FST7 set. A lot of blood gets in that back with that movement and that stretching. 